Hello guys, there you are again. Welcome back to the channel. I'm Aynot. And this is the first look on... What do you call this? Fortnite Battle Royale. So I'm not really a fan of Fortnite because I really don't know what that is. But I think this is like player unknowns Battlegrounds. But a bit cartoonish. See, because... Well, for one, instead of an airplane, you get this battle bus. So this is my first time playing this game and I hope you like this. And so yeah, let's just get on with the game. So first off, this map right here is... I really don't know how to work it because I really can't zoom it in, see, nothing has, nothing's happening. So yeah, that might be a problem, but as you can see here also, the parachuting mechanism is a bit different than the battlegrounds because you can just aim up uh, when you aim up it's just like you're just falling down and yeah this parachute is not a parachute I don't know it's called a glider and it's a little bit wonky at the time because you can't drop down you can't drop straight down fast enough so you just have to well, glide that's the point right and upon seeing here this car I can't mount it so yeah I guess we're gonna just have to go on foot and also yeah you can break stuff here in this game and that's how you get resources you get to build bases here I really don't know why I got to integrate that into my gameplay yet uh, so yeah this, you can see me I'm just gonna break stuff right here Okay, so a little tip for you guys, don't just break things, try and get some weapons, okay? So from playing this game a couple of times now, uh, I've noticed that if you want to land straight down, you just can't do it fast enough because of the glider. So I think it might be easier if you can just glide forward towards your destination. Which means getting off the school bus uh, earlier than you usually do in PUBG. If you haven't yet played PUBG, well, this is your lucky day because this is nothing new for you. This, okay, th everything's new here, okay? So that's it. So I chose to land here and I saw someone's already getting down faster than me. So I had to hurry up and the glider thing, you can just hit a wall and fall. There's no fall damage, so that's something. Okay, so basically, if you can see here, the weapons and other items are floating, so you can just easily spot them from afar. They're actually glowing, but uh, yeah, uh, you will see later on that in PUBG, you can see uh, items using your inventory, but in this game, you can't. Also, there's no aim downside. It's just like that. And yep, AK-47 sucks in this game. This is really not nice. Uh, Semi-automatic burst shots, damn. So let's get some gameplay, a real gameplay underway, okay? So let's just party first in this party bus. Okay, so I chose to land here at the same spot again. Let's hope everything goes nice. Again, use the wall thing. Oh what? Okay, so that is an invisible guy. And I saw someone at the other side, the other end of this building, I mean. Seeing beside there, shotgun, so let's just grab some things over here. Okay, I saw something that's a semi-automatic uh, pistol. I don't think I can get that guy immediately right now. Oh, okay, so if you can see that, uh, I just tried to press left alt, which means uh, free look in PUBG, but it doesn't work here. There's no free look here. So that might be problem. Also, that might be nice because, well, nobody can spot you if you're running behind them. I mean, not right now. And yeah, shotguns are pretty much the game changer in close quarter combats here all right so the only perks in having this big ass minecraft thing is that you can break stuff and you can access many parts of the game then right there i saw someone at the corner of my eye 
And of course, PUBG instincts kicking in. I try to rush him. But yeah, the sounds in this game is not that nice yet because that's the sound of the footsteps. And that's the sounds of chains breaking. I don't know what it's doing. But I just went all in right there and just killed him right away. So after searching that whole compound, I just hear these random shots all going off at a distance and yeah, judging from that sound, there are two of them. So I saw this one, tried to shot him and yeah, he's very low so I just one hit him with like, my pistol. So after looting him, I got a simple problem on my hands right now. It's inventory management. And I really don't know how to inventory manage in this game right now. And there are colors in the weapons. I don't know what that means either. So, yeah. Also, it's the suspense thingy clicking sound. That's... Okay, so, yeah, they call the gas cloud here storm clouds. But they really don't look like storm clouds. They look more like the Hunger Games electric field things. So why don't just call that? So actually if you can see the map, it's very clear here. Uh, where the storm clouds are at. And I don't know how fast these things go. But I guess we'll see. Oh yeah, if you can see at the middle right side of the screen, there's like an inventory there. 5 out of 5, I don't know what that means. But yeah, here goes the actual building mechanism of the game. And it's actually putting things together and not like an insta build. So yeah, you run out of uh, uh, resources almost immediately because it costs more so much i mean like 10 wood and 10 other stuffs depending on what your building material is so basically you can just get things out of these things i mean resources out of these things also you can hit trees and other stuffs using your bullets to destroy them which actually sucks because you can't shoot out of windows i think because it would destroy the wall entirely Okay, running along in this game again. There is. I saw this guy being shot at from the top of that house. Also, if you can see where I hit the house, it shakes a bit. That means that it's taking damage and yeah, it's just getting destroyed. That's just an easy kill. No sweat. Other guys upstairs. I can hear him by his footsteps. Trained by the Battlegrounds game that I've been playing a lot lately. I tossed that grenade. That was a hold actually. You can't hold and cook the grenade actually. So yeah, that happened. So there he is. You can see I just killed him with two shots with the shotgun while he's just trying to kill me uh, with his fucking machine guns. So weak. Okay, so let's just get ahead to the more exciting parts right here. I spot someone running over there and yeah, there's no free look here so I figured he can't see me. But apparently he can. Also, the tree has hit points. So that means I hit the tree once and I think it absorbs all the damage. I don't know. So yeah, bandaging in this game takes time also but it heals for pretty much low. I mean, it heals pretty low. Oh yeah, I almost forgot to show you guys, when you aim down sight using this sniper rifle, you get a free scope. So I think it only happens for sniper rifles, mini stuffs and other uh, guns doesn't have them. That's the aim down sight for the assault rifle. And yeah, nothing pretty much happens when you aim down sight the shotgun. I think hiding behind the bush is actually helpful I can see you and look at those shots everything is missing I don't know what's happening and yeah I'm yet to, conf to know how aiming works here and how shooting works here so keep out for that to the next videos I'll be making more of this I think I was using a shotgun which actually sucks from 
that kind of range and he was killed by this guy right here looks really awesome okay anyways thank you guys for watching uh, please leave a like leave a comment leave a suggestion down below on what i should do next probably i would do um, tutorial videos or tips and tricks for this game so i hope you like this this is the free first look of the free fortnite game that i haven't yet played or i just heard of that game right yesterday so. anyways thank you guys for watching and as per usual i'll see you guys next time